the show starts in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go. Connections have the power to make dreams come true, is the driving force behind the ONETS platform, which is totally committed to support this concept. In addition, was developed with the assistance of cutting-edge technology that utilizes artificial intelligence in order to satisfy the requirements of clients and to entice new users. By implementing superior features that can be modified to optimize each and every experience, you can improve the quality of your social network and ultimately make it more enjoyable. This amazing platform is absolutely free. All you need to do is register at www.coolzone.ai. Hey, 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 Magic Unicorn of All Passive. Hey, day after Christmas. Hope you all had a wonderful holiday with the family. Anyway, back to work. Thank you for coming. Don't forget, subscribe, ring that bell, and give Marty and Chris a thumbs up. Yep, 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 yep. Let's have fun. Alrighty then, that's him. He's uh, he's back. He's happy. He got to <laughs> he, pop a set out there and be a horse or whatever. He, he did was. not like that dog kissing your face again. He gave me the. I thought that dog wasn't coming on anymore. He told me that dog came up without even me knowing it. <laughs> I he came up so quick I couldn't even click the button. I like um, the red. I like the red. Yeah, red's cool. We can change the colors. Uh, I, I shut off any kind of restriction in the chat. You guys can chat away. I do want to tell you if you have something inspiring and something cool, we will try to post it, really. So if you want it posted and be recognized, throw it up there. Like um, work, yeah, but the holidays were good. We all did good. Mr. Mufara was on many different things. Monday, Sunday... Monday, Monday on Sunday, he was on, and then we went to another webinar, and we know that he was with us uh, last, was it 360, Chris? Yeah. Everything's. Oh, blending. he was on, oh, let's oh, yeah. oh, oh, let's, let's oh. oh. I'm never going to say that right. <laughs> we forgot right. it again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, he was on there, so. He was out in the open the whole time, and obviously he has his uh, fam family, other family. So, anyway, great day, great time. Um, grandkids had an absolute blast, and that's what it's about. Little story is Dawn got a, a shorty, an electric scooter. I didn't get it. Santa got it. Oh, yeah, Santa got it. Oh. <laughs> I didn't get it. <laughs> I forgot. Santa got it. Santa. Yeah, Santa got it. Santa so, just told her that he was going to get it for her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I made a mistake. Sorry, Shorty. Mimi told me. Jackass. <laughs> anyway, so Tom just did the gun thing and went. <laughs> You're going to get anyway, it. Anyway, listen to this. So mm, mm. they couldn't get it to move. Pushing the button, pushing the button. So I read the directions, and you have to be already rolling. 
you have to initiate it, and then you push it, it'll, it'll go. But he took off like a rocket, went right, <laughs> in, right into the kitchen sink. He goes, whoa, this is cool. And then he almost hit my computer. But anyway, he had fun. Um, on to the other things. Uh, you know, here it is the 26th of December, big things are happening. As said, they made a lot of progress even from last Wednesday. So that's good. Uh, will he be on tomorrow 360? I don't know, but the invitation's always there, and I'll make sure he gets it. So I would I wouldn't miss anything. Always, always check the back office at least once a day. Because I believe if not this week, I I really think we could hear some cool stuff this week, but every every week after for forever <laughs> big things are going to be happening uh some of the cool stuff i like is o connect if you got a great internet connection i know for a fact because it happened to me uh it's working very very well uh there's a couple little issues once in a while when you're doing stuff but they know and that's really appreciates the feedback because they want to get to a the qual, you know, a, a really high standard and push that standard every day. He said, there's another version coming. I was like, wow, I didn't even know that. And not only that, he said in 30 days, the whole thing's been revamped. So it's stack the cool, get better, stack the cool, get better, redesign the whole car. Pretty cool stuff. And, and how much does that cost us? Nothing. How much is it going to cost the consumer? The customer, nothing. That's the beauty of the company. You buy something from them, and I don't care what it is, it's upgraded constantly without you adding more money. What company you know does that? Nobody does it. Nobody. They're not upgrading the iPhone every day. No, they want you to buy one every couple of years and spend whatever it is now. They're outrageous. But really, it's pretty cool stuff. Uh, I'm sure... That Omino will be back on with uh, trivia tonight. We have put a cry out for men that know <laughs> trivia, but we nobody wants to join a, a losing team. <laughs> no, Eric's Eric's really good at it. We all answer once. What well, depends on what it is. I mean, we've gone in there and I've answered three or four right in a row. Chris, same thing. It depends what you know, right? We all have our different interests, so. She started, what you know, bringing up who's this, who's that, who was the king in you know, 1632. I don't know. I don't know who the king was today. Oh, I do know. Who it is. Oh, by the way, Casey, congratulations! Five years yesterday. Yeah, I forgot awesome. to say it. Awesome. It's okay. You can forget I, stuff. I, can I do missed it. that one. I can do it sometimes. Did um, he say he was? He said it's. His five-year anniversary, not his 500th birthday, right? That's what he's doing. No, 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 yeah. <laughs> right now, he's doing this. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. With that accent, freaking Chris. <laughs> yeah. uh, no, he's a good guy. Uh, we have good people all around. We're all different, but that makes it fun. Uh, I'm all, my thoughts are with you too, Harold. I hope you're doing good. Pat Parent, you know, we've all gone through some issues. What Brian is Croce. Say some prayers for Brian Crochet yeah. Crochet too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. I see. I see a lot of names. I, I we recognize everybody. We're up about three hundred people. Two sixty. Not bad. Um, listen, this has been emphasized by almost everyone. Start thinking about you. Start thinking about you, and let's move forward. We're not going to bring in any more founders. Why? The door's been closed for a year. We need to put on a little different hat. Are we still in the building mode? Absolutely. But I think we always will be. Ask you the scenario about this road in, in, in uh, California. It was always under construction. We're always going to be under construction, but we're always going to be better. You know what I mean? Because having that mindset where you're getting better and better and better and bigger and better and bigger and better. It's, it's beautiful. It's a great thing. Saw a video today they did. They did a blog about Onet. 
of course, I made a blog out of it. Now, let me make, let me help you understand what that means. They did a blog. I took the blog and turned it into a video, and I put CC on it so that our deaf community, deaf family, can watch it and see it written. Uh, I just put that in, the, in, and I try to do one a week. Well, I do as many as they do. If they do one, I'll make a video out of it. But the cool thing about Onet. I like to take a certain product every once in a while and just blow it up. Oh, now this free. It's really taking, it's re, it's repairing a problem. So I'm putting a Band-Aid on it, it's repairing it. It's, it's redoing an issue. And for me, the issue of uh, social media right now, uh, not to mention names, you guys know who it is. It's Facebook, all the big boys. I, I believe the idea of building this was awesome. I, there's no way those <clears throat> young kids in a dorm knew it was going to be like this. They just couldn't know. It was almost uh, it was almost luck. They threw it together. Let's get see how many people can get to talk. Now they got two or two billion people. Here's where the problem lies, and this happens to a lot of companies. You build, you get big, and things happen. And then after you become this behemoth, you start to see little doors opening that you could have you couldn't have thought of. And I'm not saying anything about Mark Zuckerberg. I don't play that. A lot of people enjoy their time on Facebook. I get it, but there's a lot of little doors open for who? Cowards, predators, nasty people, wolves in sheep's clothing. Because they they can come in, they can pretend to be somebody else, they can hack your name. I've had my my account or my name and email taken fifty times in nine years, ten years. Easy. Absolutely easy. And you go in, you change your password, and it dwindles away. But that's really sad. Because now, do I like the idea my grandchildren are on Facebook? No, not at all. And then we monitor and we listen to everything. What you do? I talk to, no, don't be talking to, no, no, he's my age. No, he may not be. That's the problem. You don't know who anybody is. Yeah, I know Chris, you know me, but there's a lot of people, nasty people. This is a perfect condition for them because they can pretend to be someone else. And the reason I'm saying that, and I brought up Onet, is when Onet is running 100%, really everything's moving, and on passive gets to that terrarium effect where we're all closed in, you know Overify is coming. Now, what does that mean? I don't like being censored. It's not censored. What it does is if I go in with Frank Rowe or um, John Barella or – Everybody here, all of you. Um, I had another person popping in. I told him Jerry Nix. Yeah, Jerry Nix. <laughs> Gina Leva. Gina Leva, definitely gifties here. All Ivana, of you. Ivana. When you, when you, uh, Narell, work on. <laughs> when Narell or all of us go there, Narell might have something she wants to post. Well, Narell has no problem saying i said it i have no problem saying i said what i said but there's a there's a small group of people that want to say something evil or nasty towards somebody else but they want to be another identity that goes back to a coward and a low life butt wipe in on passive you're gonna have to be verified now let me tell you another thing that runs through people said Verified, Facebook's doing that. Other company, they charge you every month to do that. On passive, does not charge you to be verified. In fact, when O Verify comes out, they will pay you their coins into your into your wallet that you can use for per, uh, future purchases. No joke. They pay you to be verified. Soft sensor. But I believe this, freedom of speech also means you should stand up 
and say who you are if you got something to say. Otherwise, shut up. I have an opinion. Yeah, if you have an opinion, you also have a name. <laughs> but if, if your opinion means you can't put your name behind it, keep your opinion to yourself. That's the way it should be. I'm sorry. That has nothing to do with freedom of speech. You got something to say? John Smith says this. Not uh, Mr. Z-Man wants to say something. No, bull crap. You should say your name. Anyway, that's part of uh, Onet. Onet has many features. And every feature, I'm, I'm telling you, is free. So you join. If you join right now, if you register for uh, on Passive, for one thing, you're going to be in at the very beginning. Yes, it's been here five years. But when you're this big and growing this, this massive, it's the beginning. It'll be the beginning for a year, okay, from where they're going. If you join right now, you register for free, you get three free products. One of them is on that. And while you're registering, you make a custom email, AI, custom email that you'd like to use in Omail that they also give you. Why not? Why not? And then when you go in, you're going to see a wallet. What do I need a wallet for? You can make money in Unpass. It's that simple. Want to share? Do it. You can make more money. If you don't, don't. But it's there. They have everything you could want there. And as time goes on, it's going to get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. And you can watch it happen. You can, They actually are going to build this digital mall around you for the next 10 years. So you'll already be there. You'll watch the shops be put in digitally. You'll watch the marketplace get bigger and bigger and bigger. It will go from a farmer's market to a massive global market. And by the way, you can put your stuff in there, whoever you are right now. Legit stuff, it's good. You want to share it with the, share it with the world? Nothing better than passive. Why? We're in over 200 countries. Three million people right now, minimum. Imagine 300 million or even a billion going by your store and you show them what you want to share. Guaranteed people walking by the shop. You can't beat that. And the shop was built for you. You didn't have to do it. Anyway, I wanted to cover a little stuff like that to put your mind on it. How do you think about it? There's a lot of webinars out there. Go if you, whatever, uh, whatever you do. If you're in a webinar or you see a post or you see something, we're going to have to start policing ourselves. I'm not saying go shoot people. If you see something that doesn't look right, it just doesn't sound like I'm passive. I'm passive has a certain sound. It's called ethical. I'm passive has another sound. It's called anti hype. You don't need to hype on passive. You're going to get a million dollars in one month. Why do that? That's why we're here. We're tired of hearing that crap. Don't do that. Tell the truth about Unpassive because I want to tell you something. If you went to anybody and told them everything about Unpassive that we know, obviously we can't tell them what we don't know. You tell them everything you know, they're going to think you're lying. Anyway, <laughs> they're not going to believe you because it's too good to be true. Wait, you're getting three free products. You can get a state-of-the-art conference conferencing platform for like maybe 70% less than everybody else. And actually make money for using it. Yeah, you know, it's pretty hard to wrap your head around that. So why make it even bigger than that? It's already big. It's huge. Anyway, I'm gonna turn it over to Chris and I'm leaving. I'm just kidding. I'm gonna turn it over to Chris and uh look at some of the chat. Thanks. Thanks to Garmo. <laughs> uh, first of all, uh, I hope you all had a phenomenal Christmas. I did. Um, it was good. I had a, I had, I was very good about not eating certain things. That was very good about that. I, I'm really shocked about that, but I turned down some of the most delicious things I loved and it was hard at first. And when I woke up, I felt a lot better about it. So, but it was not easy. Um, I think what I want to talk about today is, you know, we just had the celebration of Christmas, Christmas Eve, Christmas, 
uh, Monday, Thursday, all the religious stuff. And now we're coming into another, another celebration, which is 2024, which uh, in itself is pretty cool. A lot of people like going out and celebrating on the New Year's and have a really good time. And then that's it. That's it for a while. I think you have uh, the next big holiday is Martin Luther King, which is big. And then I don't know what falls after that. There's like a long gap in between. But I'm, I'm here to let you know that uh, there's another celebration that's going to be coming your way, all of our ways. It is called Impassive. I don't – uh-oh, can you hear me, Marty? I don't know if you uh, know about Unpassive. Some Someone told you, had to tell you about Unpassive, that it's a pretty big celebration what we're going through right now. Um, the CEO has opened up the uh, the window a little bit more. I was on a webinar, the Hungarian webinar, and they were saying they couldn't get in. He was going to open up for them from Croatia. I can't remember the other one. I always forget my countries, but I don't really forget them. Just a lot to go through my head, but... The celebration of, of, of something that's coming your way, which is freedom. Something new, something unique, uh, something never been done before. And of course, in all the world, if you think about it, from, from, from Jesus Christ on up, every great man or woman that lived in this world always had someone that didn't agree with them. I, that's just normal. I mean... Two plus two is four. Someone's going to come by and say, now that, that's the world. That's the world today. So hold on. Hello? 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 Hi, how are you? I, I'll call you back. <laughs> I get, all day long, I get phone calls. Um, so, and, and I want to talk about this because no matter what we do, uh, and, and Marty's right, when you actually really know about it passive, you start thinking, and there's no way. But I want to tell you something. I've already seen this system, and I'm still seeing it. It works. The uniqueness is very unique. Uh, the possibilities of earning, like Marty said, we don't talk about numbers. I'm going to say this again. I want to be the advocate that says, I never did anything, and look what I have. Uh, I got my time, and I believe that. A lot of people are so stressed out thinking, what do I got to do, Chris? What do I got to do? I don't know nothing. I don't, And that's okay. I don't know squat about squat. Now, the guy to the left or right of me, wherever he's at, he's a marketer. He knows how to do things. And what does he say? He says, Chris, let me help you. No, I don't want it. I want to be the guy that gets on a live, live YouTube, Facebook, whatever it says. Look what I got. And I did nothing. I told you for three years. Listen, and that's the, that's, that's the hardest part to believe, I think. But I'm here to tell you, uh, it's true. It's true. I'm witnessing it right now on my phone uh, for one product. I'm witnessing commissions. I would, I'm witnessing commissions from all over the world. We've got over, like Jerry Nick says, right now we've got over 3 million people in the system. In the system. And we haven't even opened basis on the world yet. Small percentage. We got some of the greatest things in the world, like the highest office in the world. I think that's pretty cool in itself. Uh, if you go to Dubai... You can't miss us. We ah, we got our own train station. We we got streets. Everything about it passive is there, and yet we still have people that say, "Come on, man!" But then I think about it. I think about the history of the world. All people that wanted to change and do good, they always had someone saying, "No, no, 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 no," and I've learned that. I believe that's going to be, the rest of my life is going to be like that. I really believe that. No matter how good you have it or how good you can help someone, there's going to be some narrow-minded individual that says, come on, that just doesn't work. But I'm telling you guys, I didn't do all the online stuff like most of you did. I worked and it sucked. 
32 years of doing something I never liked. Who's the idiot here? Me. 32 years of doing stuff I did not like. Kept saying, man, there's got to be a better way. And then I retire. And this falls on my lap. And I'm thinking, I never done that. Yeah, well, I, what do I have to lose? And I'm so glad I made that decision. I'm so I'm so glad that I had a guy named Peter Shore is a good friend of mine, says, Chris, you got to at least check this out. And, and that's what I ask people. Do, don't judge something that you know nothing about. And that's the biggest part of the internet I don't like. Because social media, it, it allows people to express their, <clears throat> excuse me, their opinions, their feelings, which is a nice thing. But it also expresses a lot of negativity. Don't do that. You could almost look up anyone on the internet and it's going to say something. Oh, no, not this guy. But I'm here to tell you with this guy next to me that this is the most real company I've ever seen in my life. And I worked at a big real company for 32 plus years. All right. Um, the difference was I had to show up every single day. This is the funny part about me. I drove so much. Back and forth for 32 years that I didn't even like driving anymore. When I got to work, I was driving cars every day. Nice cars. And it drove me insane. And I can remember sitting there on, on the 15th or 16th hour on a seven-day work week schedule. And I'd say to myself all the time, what am I doing? And then Friday would roll along, roll come along, and I'd get this wow. And I'd see that big money. That's why I'm doing this. But it took me on a vacation to realize that I just don't want to do this anymore. And I, I thought I, I made it to the top. I did it. I made the 32 years. And then the passive came along. And I thought, man, I really want to work for this company. I want to work hard for it. I'm going to push myself because I believe in it. And it's not just for me. It's for my family first, my friends, my relatives. Anyone that wanted it, and I, I'm not going to lie, I had a lot of people tell me no. I got people that right now say I'm crazy. Don't do this, don't do that. And you know what? I don't want to listen to people anymore. In my heart, I know this is right. In my heart, I know this is where God wanted me to be. It's real, guys. There's a lot of people out there that are against us. Because they really have nothing better else to do. I wish they would just join us. I wish they just would have jumped in our vehicle and tried it out like they can every single day. But they don't. That's the, that's part of life that lets us down sometimes. But don't let a person... Listen, I believe in myself, number one. I've always believed in myself that I can do this. I can make it better. I, I'm in a company now where the CEO thinks exactly how I thought I could do this. I could make it better. And when he says I can make it better, he's talking about the world, not his bank account. He's talking about countries, kids, women, all over the world that don't have anything. And I want to give you something. I'm going to say it again. This unique business called Impassive, it works. We're slowly coming into the world. And is everything always perfect? No, we got little things that we're tweaking and twerking. I'm, I'm not going to lie about that. It's brand new global company. It's technology. It's connected to every single country in the world. And if, as far as I know, it's heading on, on its way to Mars on some satellite, if I know Ash Mafara. Okay? It's real, guys. But I'm going to tell you this. I'm on here because I'm talking to you founders because I want to give you some reinsurance because a lot of you, for some reason, you, you lose it a little bit there. You stop believing. Don't stop believing because this company is going to make you a believer of everything. When you make your first sale, which probably most of you already have, and then you think about that times it by 10. 20, 30, and keep going because there's no cap on it. I had so many people, this is impossible, Chris. There's no way that he could do this. And I'm here to tell you, I see it. I'm witnessing it. He has done it. One product, we got a whole bunch more coming. And we're not talking about the physical products. We're not talking about the server centers. 
We're not talking about the mobile things he's got all over the place. The inventions. And what does he say? I want to share it all with you guys. I just want to share it out with you guys. I want to change your life. And I see something on the internet and I'm like, oh my God, that's that's not my CEO. Who made up that lie? But see, that's what people are attracted to. They're, they're attracted to that negative. Wow, what can I get out of this? What do I see? Follow people that believe in something. Everyone's got to believe in something. But I'm going to tell you, I absolutely believe in God. But I, absol I absolutely believe that this company is a God-fearing company. And it's being head by a lot of people that believe in God. And it's been helped. Definitely our CEO. He's a man. I'll be the first one to tell you. I seen him. I gave the guy a hug. He's a real man. He's just a very smart man. He's a very caring man. He's compassionate. But this company is real. Yep, I'm going to have 100 people saying, you're wrong. And you know what? I don't need to show you what I've made because I have. I, I believe in blind faith, man. You're going to have to trust me on that. The people that do know me or Marty, you should trust us. We don't do this every day. There's nothing in this for us to do this every day but to get you excited and to let you know there's something brand new and unique. It's the next big celebration, folks. Celebrate New Year's in the next five or six days, whatever it is. I'm going to celebrate by getting in my bus, my RV, and driving the hell all over the place. But the next celebration is on passive. The next product, withdraws, sales commissions, 25 freaking percent. Show me someone else that's doing that right now. And, and do I look serious right now? This BDI, no sleep, bushy haired, chubby guy is telling you, I worked 32 years, it sucks. I've wanted this my whole life. It's here and I'm happy. And I'm going to work my arse off to keep telling the world about it one way or the other. But believe this company, it will change the world and it will change lives. You got a birthday today. Happy birthday. Praying for our friends. And I'm also praying that you at least check out our three free products to any of these people on this chat. Any YouTube you see about a passive. Check it out. It's worth checking out. Marty DeGarmo, back to you. Fantastic. And by the way, if you're watching this, only join under me. I'm just kidding. Oh. Yeah, I'm talking. Uh-oh. Hey, hey, everybody, I'm talking. Chris says you guys can Put your can't little button on the bottom. Anyway, I want put your thumbs up I if you can hear, hear me. It's only Maybe it's Chris. me. Can you guys hear him? I can hear you. I can't hear you. My my thing's showing that they can hear me. Hey guys, can you guys in the hear chat, Marty in here? Give me a hey, I can hear here. you, Marty. Oh, maybe it's me. Thanks, thanks, thanks. I'm seeing. That's scary. Uh, can you somebody, hear me? Somebody text my phone if you can hear Marty. Thank you, Chris. <laughs> I don't think anybody can hear me. <laughs> I can hear you. Lori Lund said, I can hear you. Yes, 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 yes. Thumbs up. You see anything yet? Yeah, they're all saying they can hear me. Yes, they can hear me. It's you. No, I'm not. <laughs> I, I think it's me. Can everyone hear Marty or no? Yeah. They can, they can hear you? Yeah. All right, I can't hear you. Just go talk. I'll figure it out. Because he can't hear you, he won't shut up. Anyway, uh, one thing I wanted to say, a couple things I want to say. Let's keep in mind you're always right. Okay, so if you believe you can, you can. If you believe you can't, you can't. On path that makes it right. Right? This is the path to get you right. You're, everybody wins. So do it. Please do it. I was joking about everybody signing up under me. I was trying to make Chris laugh, but he can't hear me, so it didn't work. Um, Another thing I want to tell you, and this is from a personal note, and this goes out to anybody uh, that was having issues health-wise, maybe from being a large individual. I started off with keto, and it really changed my life a lot. 
But then I changed into the carnivore diet, and I feel like I was born again. No joke about it. No joke about it. I look at my hand, and it, I don't even recognize it. I went down like two ring sizes. I'm melting. I've already gone two shirt sizes, and this one is turning into a tent. So it works, and I feel great. And I'm feeling better every day. As I get older, I'm feeling better. That's pretty rare. I couldn't squeeze my hand. All the I was getting knuckles, big, big balls on here like arthritis, you know. Uh, they're going away. I'm just telling you. It, it worked for me. I, I can't, I'm not giving you doctor's advice. My doctor never told me to do carnivore. I looked at videos, I watched people, and I said, I need to take the things into my own hands. Look at John White. Look at Chris Johnson. Chris is doing it. I've been talking to him about it. And then finally he did it. And I said, you, and let me tell you, when you're not in it, you eat sugar and carbs. When you see sugar and carbs, you can't walk past them. You're going to eat them. He went two days, big, big parties and didn't eat it. So it, it really helps. I just want to say it because I, I, I want people to feel as good as me. Especially if you're having a breathing problem or whatever, because it actually takes away the fat inside you. Reversal, reversal, re, visceral fat around your heart, around your lungs, and that's the difference in breathing. So it changed my life, saved my life. So I'm just saying it. Um, my granddaughter's starting in a couple of days with me, oh, Alexis. Um, the other thing I wanted to say is, Lystra, are you okay? Because I I never see you before noon on here. So I just want to make sure you're okay. Because I know you ain't coming on here at 10 in the morning. You know, I'm joking with you, Lystra. It's funny to see you, though. She goes, I can't get up that early. But she was here. Anyway, love all of you. John, keep doing what you're doing. Anybody else? If, you, if you're getting older in health and you think, you know, that's just part of age, it's not. Wh why not live to your, your, your full potential health-wise? Look, I'm not saying it's going to make you live longer, but why, why not a better quality of life while we're here? That's all I'm saying. Um, what else we have? I guess that's it. Thank you, everybody out there. Uh, I'm stoked. I can I hear him. <laughs> By the way, guys, you can stop texting. I can hear him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't know what happened, Chris, as soon as you stopped yeah, talking. I remember my. Remember, I said, oh, can you hear me? It said my headset shut off. So I just went and clicked it on regular computer. So it's good. I don't know why Did it shut off. Battery go dead? No. I just oh. I must have hit something. He did. Maybe you lifted this. <laughs> I had that off and on, but I, I, I might hit the button on the side or something. I don't know. Yeah, I might have. Okay. Anyway, we're going to go. Thank you, everybody. Huge gratitude and family. I absolutely never, ever stop praying for us and the family. Uh, what they've done, his wife, his wife has got to be an amazing, amazing person. Anybody that would, would partner up with what Ash is doing, oh, my God, I can't even imagine. Can't even imagine. When a, when a good day is bad, <laughs> you know it's rough. Uh, anyway, appreciate it. Tomorrow, 360. It'll be in O'Connect, obviously. Links will go out tomorrow, maybe after the live. Maybe before. Like I said, keep your eyes open. Keep checking the back office. Oh, the updates. Wait, Red is not coming on today, guys. No Red at 11. Yeah, he was actually wasn't going to be able to get back till Thursday, but I said we got 360 Wednesday. He'll be showing up for that, but he will not be on today. Absolutely, we're over 300 people. Not bad, not not bad. Uh, thank you, everybody. I mean that, and we care about you. I, I, if you don't know that by now, then you have a problem. Especially you, Listra. Especially Listra. Especially Listra. <laughs> and Manu. And Manu. Oh, I want to say. A big shout out to Manu because she did a Christmas day at noon, I think it was. A lot of people didn't have family to spend. She made another webinar and brought them in just so, you know, they could do a little Christmas thing. So I thought that was pretty cool. I didn't make it, but 
I know a lot of people did. So thanks for doing that, Manu. All right, let's wrap this up. See you all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I know the answer to that question. Almost a million, about a million people, Stephen. I asked.